Well, we got forcibly evicted. Due to those circumstances, we need to head away from our first ever base camp. At least until things cool down over there. Finding a second suitable base might be a bit harder than expected. Especially with how frigid things can get. We can only last around 10 minutes outdoors before things get dangerous. Oh, why couldn't Summer just rear its head one last time? Alrighty guys, welcome back to another episode of Project Zomboid. Uh, I'm just chilling here. There's a little bit of commotion going on. Uh, one of those bastards triggered an alarm. I'm just trying to watch uh, TV shows and I'm trying to go back to sleep. We didn't get a lot of sleep here. Honestly, should have been sleeping on the second story. But yeah, we're going to continue on our nice little journey. <laughs> it's still snowing. It's always going to be snowing now, brother. There's nothing we can do about that one. So yeah, we're just going to watch a little bit of TV. That's a lot of zombies. I am hearing a lot of commotion right now. Oh, God. Okay, well, I got my uh, Spaz 15. So, um, I'm just saying I will curb blam you. Uh, <laughs> I will curb blam you. There's no ifs, ands, or buts. Oh, God. Yeah, that's not good. That's not good at all. Okay, so we kind of have a little bit of a situation. <laughs> we need to find a good base. End of story, uh, we're not going to be able to live long here at all. What we could do, actually, be a little bit safer with our descent. We could, uh, remove some of these curtains and turn, um, get some sheet rope going. I don't feel confident here at all. That's a lot of infected, <laughs> not infected, just uh, crack fiends b below me. Okay. I'm, I'm gonna take that, uh, that door on the other side. We're gonna hop out. Honestly, I don't know where the fuck to go. But anywhere is better than here right now. That's all I can say. Oh, I hope there's no one on this back alley here. Okay, let's add an escape rope. There we go. Let's do it. Hello. Goodbye. Got a blast. And shooting stars. Buy candy bars. Alan Johnson is out forever. Okay. Let's hop inside here real quick. Take a little break. Maybe look for some coffee. Sardines. Let's eat those right now. All right. We just need we need to go like fo full loot goblin right now. I don't know where the hell we're going to be going, but I think we're going to head up north this way. Maybe towards the city a little bit more. I want to check out that. I, we, we need a vehicle is what we need. All right. We need one bad man. Hold on. There might be some life and living, so I might chill here for a little bit. Let's just go check this out real quick. Come on. I know life and living. Oh, does it open up at six? It does. That's even more cooking <laughs> skill. Oh, uh, we really don't need cooking skill, but uh, I will take it anyways. <laughs> don't mind if I do. I just want to make sure that everything's looking good in the neighborhood. Probably going to need to fill up our water bottle a little bit more. We're just trying to vibe right now. We really don't have that much food. We have a bunch of potatoes that should last us a little while while we make our way over. Honestly, might head over to where Kyle was in his original series. That is uh, quite a while away, though, you know, I, I don't know. I just want to leave this area, you know. Yeah, I don't really feel like I should stay here. Now, do we have... Okay, we do have a big hiking bag. So the only, the only one we can get right now that'll be good is a military backpack. And the chances that we get one of those uh, is pretty low. Okay. Program is done. Let's just continue heading down. <gasps> okay, we're good. That's what I call a pro gamer strap right there. I need to check out this vehicle down over here. Just don't mind me. I'm just stopping on in here. We're already losing temps very quickly. That door is broken down a little bit scary. Uh, tire pump. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hop it. How much do vehicles actually, uh, it's locked. Okay, we're not going to get anything out of this thing then. Let's just hop inside. Okay. We're going to leave. Uh, I see, I see some naked zombies in there and that really doesn't vibe well. Hey man, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to room with you a little bit if that's all right with you, man. <laughs> I'm just going to room with you. There we go. Sorry, buddy. Kind of took out half of your face there, but uh, I kind of need to rest up for a hot minute. Give me them ciggies. Give me them nails. Club hammer. Not as good. Okay. We'll just chill out for a little bit. You know, chillax. Calm down. Calm her down. Okay, we're warming up. Let's go. Oh, yeah. It's a, it's a snowy day here. Very snowy. Very scary. 
The wind is blowing. The trees are going. Hey, man. I'm gonna have to take you out now. Good old hammer to the back of the head. Always does it. <laughs> See you later, alligator. Owski. Nice. Kind of useless because you're literally in a garage, but I appreciate the sentiment nonetheless. Uh, another lighter, some more ciggies. Hey, I'll always take some cigarettes. Honestly, this entire series is going to be pretty stressful. We're literally just base hopping right now. Okay. Uh, ooh, we got a lot of vehicles here. Oh, yeah, we got a crap ton. Oh, if we could get lucky. Now, there are a lot of infected here as well. So, we're going to have to stay a little bit, uh, a little bit on the prowl. I don't want to head up there. Okay, I want to stay near this fence line as well. See if we can just find anything here. Please, I need a working vehicle so badly in my life. Okay. The naked ones are the runners, so we just have to watch out for them. Just keep on heading on down. They can't even see me in all this mist, which is good for me. Okay, all this is locked. We're gonna need to find a quick little spot to just hop in for a minute. So I think I'm gonna head over towards this like little store looking deal. And we're just gonna tug the side, slip right on in. The window's already open. Look at that. Okay. There we go. <laughs> uh, really makes you think about... Hey, lady. Thank you. Oh, she's just gonna leave us behind. I'm glad I picked a stealthy character for this. Honestly, Alan is a is gonna be a ninja if he survives any longer. So, hopefully he does. I have a lot of faith in Alan, actually. Sure, we did get scratched at the start, but infection is disabled. So there's going to be no cheeky bite that ends the whole series. If I die, I'm going to have to get ripped apart by like 10 different zombies all going at me at once. Uh, that's the only way my boy Alan's going to go. He's going to go down in a, in a group. All right. Big old group hug. Big old group style. Just death incarnate. Okay. We got books. Teetery. Insurance. Bargain. Bargain clothes might have what I need. Also, I want to check out Enigma books real quick as well. I don't really like how dark it is in here, but... Just pop open that. Okay. We're going to be just keeping an eye out for maybe like tailoring for beginners. That might be pretty nice, actually. Uh, come on. Anything else? Anything wacky here? Anything real wacky? I don't really see much right now. Pretty disappointing. Angler magazine. <laughs> A lot of angler magazines. First aid for beginners. Book. I'll take book. Book is nice. Book is... You can appreciate book. Book is eternal. <laughs> Yeah, okay, we're not gonna find much here, which is pretty disappointing. Let's just continue heading down. I want to make it to the, uh, I could care less about the food. I'll be honest. Yeah, maybe we'll go check it out a little bit. Uh, it could be something good. Well, what's good? Good, good. Uh, I messed that up completely. Ooh, pie. Yoink. Yum, 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 yum. There we go. <laughs> Very nice. Thank you for the pie, Mendy. I appreciate you. I appreciate you a lot. Hey, buddy. Just gonna shut that door on you real quick there. Hop on outside. Bash in your brains. Negative 76 degrees Fahrenheit. You know, pretty pretty poggers. Pretty poggers, indeed. All these are unlocked, which I do appreciate. A crap ton. Jeans, striped shirt. Come on, give me something good. Round neck sweater. Ah, damn. I was really hoping for a military bag here. Maybe we can get, like, a, a mask would be nice. Good hat. I could always appreciate good hat. Probably not gonna- no, we're not gonna get lucky with anything, are we? Nope. Alright. Well, that was completely useless to go check out. Um, it's only 8 a.m., so we still got a lot of the day left to actually get going. Shove you over, bashing your brains. Okay. Let's head down, try and find a vehicle, if we could find a ve Ooh, okay, I'm kind of- I'm kind of vibing with this house right here, actually. Uh, it's all locked, dude. Come on, man. Why you gotta be locked in here? Why- why is it locked, lady? Can you explain me that real quick? Come on, take her out. Ah, oh, one more. There we go. Yeah, I- I do like this spot. The only problem is like... Hey, could you- could you get shoved over real quick? I have to deal with this lady behind me. She might be a sprinter. So like, I gotta- I gotta- Come on, lady! Okay. It's locked, of course it is. We might need to make a beeline back towards a- Ah! I need to get inside! It's freezing out here! <laughs> I need to warm up for a minute. Hey, lady. I'll give a shot. Okay, this is a good gun. I just want to- I just wanted to make, to make sure- Come on. Idiot nincompoop head. There we go. 
don't know why I call them idiots. Hey, uh, does jewelry, uh, help you? No, it doesn't. I don't like this, man. I'm just trying to warm up here. Okay, well, uh, I think we do need a can opener now, so we will take that. Uh, we really got screwed over, man. I don't know. Just pretty painful to think about all that we lost, but we can always go back there later. Maybe when things are a little bit more chill. We're probably just gonna need to be running back and forth anyways. Especially with how- ooh, nine mil rounds. Hey, don't mind if I do take those. Pretty common weapon caliber. I wouldn't be surprised if we did come across some nine mil later on here. And a tea bag. That's going- that's go- that's going in the fanny pack right there. Yep. That- that's a fanny pack thing. Might not be able to carry much in there. But the fanny pack stays. <laughs> Hell yeah. I'll put away the shotgun shells in my main inventory, though. That'll help us out a little bit. It's really cold here, man. I'm freezing my butt cheeks off. I mean, this is a really good base. I just, I don't know if I want to settle for something this small. I mean, the only problem is, like, this frontal area is just, I'd have to barricade one, two, three, four, five, six entrances, and I don't know if that's exactly worth it. So, yeah, I think I'm going to ignore that for now. I do like the backyard, and I'm going to memorize that there is a... That there is a... Gr a, 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 a... A... A grill in the back. I don't know why it took me so long to think of a grill. But that is, uh, very nice. Okay, let's go. Oh, it is so cold out. Okay. That's, uh, I don't know why I... Um, honestly, uh, the roads are getting bigger as well, which is... A little bit of a disappointment. Let's just try and avoid these idiots to the best of our ability. None of them are sprinting at me, which is always a welcome sight. Oh, that's a lot. That's a lot. They can't see me, though. This blizzard is honestly working in my favor so hard right now. Ooh, mama. Okay, that's a, that's a big group. That That's an explosion one. Okay, that's not good. Let's just hop in here. Oh, yeah, that's an explosion, zombie. Please let me in. If there's an alarm, I will cry. I will threaten you with a good cry, an ugly cry, a big old fat one, just ripping it out here. <laughs> okay, we're good. I want to avoid the, the the burning zombie because that thing will actually kill me. They are fast as well. That's the scariest part. All right, we'll just take it calm here. Honestly, what I'm looking for right now is a is a is a is a varsity jacket. One of them bad boys would be so nice right about now because the leather jacket's cool and all. But, um, it, it, it takes away my run speed. And that's not very cash money of it to do, you know. Okay, we're ready to hop out. Let's go. It. Let's do it. We just got to keep on heading up north. It's like Fahrenheit. I don't know. I don't know. Ooh, that's a police. Dude, that's a police car. Okay, I do want to check that out. But if I'm going to do that, I'm going to have to clear out these zombies. Oh, that's a, that looks like an XMN10. Woo! Okay, come on. Hop. Please pop it open. Please let me in. I am freezing. Boink. See you later. Come on, let me in. Yeah, there we go. We're in. This is actually pretty nice. Uh, it's a nice little trapping cabin here. Yeah, this is a real nice trapping cabin. I like that gun, though. Sir, would you please hand me your weapon? <laughs> I need it more than you right now. I'll be completely honest with you. I'll be open with you, sir. That's a Glock. 18 pistol right there and uh Bellini M4 Super 90. Yeah, I like that. I like that more than my spaz 15 actually come on in Push you over shut the door bash in your head with this hammer. Okay, this is good How good is it compared to my spaz 15 now because the spaz 15 weighs quite a bit 4.09 1.19. Okay, a little bit better contains a magazine uh, For do 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 damage is pretty good on it I like the I like the look of the Bellini, and that's how I'm gonna go at things. <laughs> okay, I'll remember that the Spaz uh, 15 is here. Go rack it out as well. We'll drop it off here. Oh, no, not my key ring. I can't replace that, but I can replace the Spaz 15. I'm also gonna be taking that Glock. Yeah, 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 yeah. There we go. Alrighty, things are looking good. Give give me that uh, give me the guns now. Give me the cheese. The Glock 18 is actually really good. The only problem is it weighs just about the same as a uh, it's a shotgun. You know, you're, you're getting a little bit more. We could also fold in the stock. Okay, hold on. This M4 Super 90 might be the trick. I like the look of it a lot. Okay. Yep, it's quick to aim. Definitely good. So if we uh, fold in the stock. 
Um, what did that do for me? Absolutely nothing. We can extend it, melee mode, rack. Okay, we'll get a couple more rounds in here. This one's at uh, semi-auto as well, I think, right? No, this is just full auto and semi-auto. <laughs> I'm kind of dumb. But we could also go into melee mode. So we could use... This thing is... Hey. Shoulder, fold, repair. I like this. I like this weapon a lot, actually. There we go. I think it actually weighs a little bit more, but honestly, I think it's worth it. This bad boy is going to help us out quite a bit. And I don't know. I'd rather have a shotgun on my character than a um than anything else right about now. I just wish I was a little bit stronger. <laughs> that's that's it. Oh, what I'd do if I was strong. I used to be strong like you. Uh, eraser matches. Nothing too wacky here. Probably not gonna get much out of this place. What I, I what I would do for a uh, full on uh. Honestly, it's probably like all the clothing that I'm wearing <laughs> that's like weighing me down quite a bit. Also the fanny pack. Honestly, I might just ditch the fanny pack. I'll just drop it in my actual bag. It don't really matter too much. That'll help out with a little bit of weight. I wish the fanny pack had a little bit more of a use, to be honest. It's just kind of... It's just kind of there, you know? Nothing too wacky with it. It's just... I don't really see the point in it sometimes. I will take the video game, though. I am a born gamer, so it's obvious that I will be taking that. I'll also be putting away my water bottle lighter in these two sheets into my bag, so we can kind of run away without much of a problem. V-neck, closed jacket, yada yada, nothing too wacky here. What I might do, actually, I'm gonna put away my hammer as well, and I'm gonna equip my rancher machete. Yeah, I, if, I, if, I'm, if, I'm, if I want something, I want something good. Though, to be honest, the Winchester Model 1894 is one I wanna carry with me, like normally. The range is good, but right now, we really can't afford that. So we'll just continue heading, ooh. I'm seeing a lot of vehicles here. The chances that we actually get a working vehicle might be in our favor right now. So let's just see. Come on. Oh, it's locked. Why is it all locked? Please. I just need a single vehicle, but a crumb. I need a pebble, please. Oh, it's all locked. Why is it locked? I swear to God, if the box truck works, I'm going to I'm going to die. I'm going to die so fast. Lock is broken. OK, it's your Ooh, baseball bat. Hey, yo, that's actually pretty good. I'll take that. Hell yeah, baseball bats are great. Okay, we are getting very cold now. We ought to find a place to warm up. Um, let's go ahead into this this house right here. This house right here looks very cash money. Don't mind me. I'm just hopping on by. Yep. Ooh, survivor home. Poggers. This is my new base now. Come on. There we go. Let's just hop inside. Ooh. Absolutely frigid out here. Oh, mama. Military baton. Sounds pretty cool. Okay, we're gonna have to clear this place out, but I think this is our best call. And honestly, yeah, 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 I, I, I like this spot. Um, there is another fenced in area over there, but this is completely surrounded. It's literally completely surrounded. The other thing that I'll probably have to do is, um, I'm gonna prepare it right now while I'm warning, warming up here. I'm gonna get these shelves, I'm gonna place them in front of the gates. So like, we'll, we'll be kind of vibing. And this one I like because unlike the previous house, uh, this one has a fence all the way around it. So I feel very safe. Hello. I would like to take you out to dinner, lady or ma'am. Sorry it has to be this way. Honestly, I should be using my baseball bat right about now. Let's use the baseball bat. I want to save my, um, the ranch machete because that is honestly so, it's, it's, it's a lot of bang for your buck is what it is. Okay. We could drop the ranch machete. We could, let's just drop off like, I don't know, some st the potatoes can go right now. There we go. I just want to be, like, good in the neighborhood. There we go. Please, I would like to stay here for an extended warranty. Could, could, could I? I think I will. I don't even need to ask. Come on. I don't know why I'm doing, like, the, the old voice when I'm, like, the, like, the kind of, like, just the... Ooh, is that a bag? No, it ain't. Kind of got my hopes up for nothing, lady. I hope you know what you did. Bro, <laughs> this is pretty insane, dude. Like, holy shit, man. I do like this spot, though. I like it a lot. And there's also a dead man. A lot of dead people. We could actually disassemble a lot, like these the barricades, so we can hop on in. Okay. They did get in. There's like a few hundred thousand. Okay, let's just hop inside the garage real quick. I might be um, killing myself here. Okay. As long as none of them are the sprinter. Or, 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 not sprinting, or just, I don't like Mr. X. 
Okay, that guy is honestly the bane to my existence. That's why I want to get the barricade done and out of the way. So in order to do that, we're going to need to clear out the rest of this area, though. So let's get started. Let's get cleaning. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. A baseball bat knows best, and it knows when to kill. There we go. Let's go take a little uh, drink of Wawa real quick. Aki Wawa. There we go. All right. We're back in the game, baby. Yeah. Yeah, see, this, this group right here needs to go. I don't like them vibing here, so I'm going to make my uh, complaint known very thoroughly, sir. I don't like you here. I don't like your presence. I don't like how you bring down the market value of this neighborhood. There we go. Uh, a few more idiots there, but they're kind of vibing right now. So we'll just leave them be. That's a shotgun right there. Ooh, what kind of shotgun you got there, buddy? Ah, I think that's that's the vanilla one. I'll be honest here. Yeah, that's a, okay. Well, whatever. We'll take it in a little bit. We just have to take it very slow. We are losing temperature very quickly. <laughs> it's just a bunch of like hopping in, hopping out. Here we go. Okay, rest up for a minute. We have a shotgun on us. So here's my plan right now. I'm going to drop the military baton. I'm going to pick this up. I'm hearing a lot more infected. Oh, this is going to be so difficult to do. All right. Everything's going to be all right. Please tell me I can't take the extra shelf right now. Okay, we'll drop the hiking bag right now. Drop it on the floor, please. Thank you. We got a baseball bat. We got a shotgun. If a zombie does decide to say hi, that's running. We will blast a shotgun, hurry up, drop the fence, and then continue on our merry way. First things first, I want to shut this. There we go. I want to get the outside done, and then I'll work on the inside. Okay. No one sees where we are right now. We'll work from the inside out, and then go from there. Yeah. Okay. We need to get this place secure. So we need two more fences from the outside here. Oh, yeah, I guess we could use that little bit of a shortcut. <laughs> that works. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, let's go grab another two. We need number one, number two, pop them in. There we go. We got like three more shelves to work with. So we'll get the outside. Wait, actually, um, oh, I'm kind of stupid. Yeah, that fence does not help at all in that position, does it? Yeah. Uh, kind of did a little bit of an oopsie there. Whatever. Drop that down. Okay, let's hurry up, pick this up. And drop it down actually like on the thing okay it's all right this place is gonna be impenetrable by the time we're done with it we don't even know what's inside like that's the best part of it as well okay bam okay that's uh that's all good in the neighborhood let's go actually hop inside this building now i want to get the fridge in front of the smaller one here so yeah maybe we'll go do the outside as well now Whew. It is terrible out. Oh, jeez. I think that deserves a potato. <laughs> if, I, if I do say so myself, that does deserve a potato. That is a very potato moment. Okay, go take another shelf. We are getting actually tired here. I might honestly... Ooh, that's not good. I sure hope they don't see where I'm at. Okay, just add in another shelf here. Don't worry, they don't know where I'm at. These zombies really like trigger triggering their alarms, though. <laughs> oh, gosh. This is literally like the your worst nightmare, to be honest. Are that, is that banging from the inside? It better be. These metal shelves are expensive, you know. <laughs> they are very expensive. Okay, I'm going to... Yeah, it's coming in from the inside. We don't have to worry. Okay. Sit on the ground for a quick little bit. Let's go have another... We'll, we'll have to have a little bit of coffee here. So let's go grab our hammer as well. We're going to need that. Uh, yeah, hammer. We'll go say we'll go say hi in a little bit. Don't worry about a thing. I just want to make sure everything's good in the neighborhood. Yeah, we'll, we'll eat... Um, hmm. We'll have a quarter of this coffee. There we go. All right, things are looking good. Let's go put that away. Let's go get this one last shelf down. There we go. Okay. Well, I, I'm not done barricading this thing. I want to actually extend it out like a couple of ways as well. Like, I want this thing to be safe. I want to. I want. I, I want to make sure that like if I'm getting attacked, that nothing is getting in and nothing is getting out. You know. Okay. They are definitely smashing. Come on. Pop it open. I really hope it just opens. There we go. We're in. If there's an alarm, I'm going to cry. 
I'm gonna cry. Hey, we got a medium gun case here. Pretty cool. Let's see what a Oh, we got another <laughs> Wow, remaining MD65s are very common here. Okay, we know there's an idiot in there. Just want to make sure there's no one else around. Alrighty, sir. Oh, you're right there. I didn't. I was not expecting that, sir. <laughs> there we go. Okay, I think there's one more idiot in here. And then that'll be it. This is a dead body, but like, you know, that's just a given. Ooh, okay. Hello, I know you're back here. Welcome. Howdy. <laughs> Sorry I have to do this to you, but like, you know, duty calls, I'm kind of doing my own thing right now, you know, just sometimes. Okay, sir, you are, whew, took a lot there. And we got the house key. Very cool. Oh, this place is now ours. For uh, the most part, I'm going to have to do a little bit of TLC here. I want to make sure that there's no, like, ways that they can see inside right now. We got power still, so that's nice. Okay, let's see what we're cooking with in terms of uh, firepower now, huh? This is going to be our safe house for a little bit. Ice pick, lead pipe, metal pipe. Pretty cool stuff. Chips, uh, corned beef, spaghetti. Wow, this is like normal. I was, that's what I'm talking about. That right there. Truger 1022. Hey, that might actually be a really good weapon. We got a box of 22s. Hey, fuck yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Pretty good. 38 special. Oh, if I could get back to my original base, I'd be able to use a revolver then. So we have a K2 rifle. We got a Ruger 1022. We need a silencer is what we need. I don't feel... Oh, another rancher machete. And some shotgun shells. Well, how do you do? What's in here? Sugar? Ah. Uh, okay. Honestly, shouldn't be complaining that I even got a survivor house in the first place, especially with the place that has a fence around it. Oh, hold on. We got one more. Damn it. <laughs> All right. Let's, uh, let's finish off this whole thing now. I think I'm going to sleep in here for sure. I like it here near. I like it a lot in here. Alrighty. I don't know if I'm going to use a fridge, to be honest. I don't know. I feel like I could use something else a little bit more, uh, a little bit more out there. Though, mm, fridges are just nice. I mean, like, yeah, I'm just going to use a fridge. I don't really care about, uh, <laughs> stuff lasting that long. It doesn't really matter at the end of the day. Yeah, give me that. Give me it. We actually have a mini fridge. Damn. Okay. Okay. Well, shoot. This place is vibing. We have a very nice one entrance area as well. Okay. Let's go, uh, just pop open one more. We're going to have to hop a fence after this point. I also want to make sure this place is completely cleared out before I decide to call it a day. Okay. Get that fridge right on the outside here. There we go. Now I feel a lot safer. I would like to get a vehicle in front of these, even though like it won't do much for right now. Just having that like a little bit would help out quite a bit. Hello. I see you have uh, entered my domain. I would like to take you out so that I may not have to deal with you in the future. Okay. This is our base now. We're gonna have to hop the fence every time or we're gonna have to move the fridge out of the way, but that's all right. I take safety and plus my character's athletic. So it don't really matter that much to be honest. We got a gamer set up in here as well. That's pretty cash money. Anyways, I think I'm going to end the episode here. Do we have a fireplace? We should definitely have a fireplace in here. Right? Come on. Yeah, we don't. Aw. That's a bummer. Oh, whatever. Honestly, I'm winning either way right now. <laughs> uh, I'm going to go drop off my loot now. We got... We got some weapons. The Ruger 1022 doesn't have a lot of damage though, and it weighs quite a bit. But like, you know... It is what it is. Anyways, I think I'm going to end it here. I'm going to go grab my stuff, actually, from the back area. And, yeah. Pretty good episode, all things considered. If you guys like this episode, please like, favorite, share. Subscribe for more. I will see you guys. Oh, that's an alarm. Please turn that off right now. Oh, God. Okay. We're good. <laughs> that was a little bit scary. I sure hope no one heard that. Uh, I, I would be very sad if someone did. Okay. We got all of our weapons. Everything's good in the neighborhood. Honestly, I would love to level up strength to at least level six. That, that, that'll that take a long time, though, so I don't know about that. Anyways, I'll see you all in the next episode. I'm going to be doing a little bit of inventory management now. So, yeah, I should have fun with that.